Okay, so like I was gonna do this with my actual camera, but its battery just died, so I'm gonna do this way. I'm just gonna show you the vegetables I have in my garden today. So okay, this is cilantro, which I got a lot bigger since I planted it. This is a little smaller since I planted it, but it's rosemary. some thyme right here. It's got flowers. Which look pretty. They're like a light lavender. This is an onion that I originally was going to be eaten, but I decided I wanted to plant it instead because it had a little bit of green on it. And I'm like, oh, it wants to grow. So I planted it. I did have some cabbage here, which there might still be a piece here. Not really. It kind of died because it got too cold. I think these little things right here are my lavender. That don't belong in there. You can leave a little tree, but not in my raised bed. Give me their little seed. Right, so I think that is my lavender. And it somehow got over here, even though I planted it way over there. These. This is a mixture of wild carrots and my carrots. And I have my chamomile over here with my little statues. Very unknown statues. And I have a little fox over there. And. And then cut the shirt right here because like I have more plants in the greenhouse but I just well I guess I could travel there. Yeah, let's just walk over there. Oh, oh, oh. These are strawberries. Another strawberry. This one is actually growing a strawberry. And this is a cone flower. I accidentally picked it earlier in the season, thinking it was a weed, but then I found out it was my plant because it had roots that looked like my plant's roots. And this is a blueberry bush, which had a spider on it, but I guess it ran away. But yes, it's starting to grow again, which is awesome. Maybe this year I'll have some blueberries. I don't know what these are, but they're growing and they look like an actual plant. Go over. This is Rosie because of the color of her flowers, but she's actually in patient flat that I've been growing for three years. Not supposed to be able to do that, but I did it because I take it inside when it gets cold. This is a greenhouse. This basil plant didn't quite make it, but I'm Still hoping since its roots are nice and wet that it will grow back. This is a agatash. That's what that is. Mm, it will grow some flowers like that and it will attract butterflies and repel the deer. I don't know what that is. What is that? I don't know what that is. Oh well. Anyway. Here's some more of my carrots, and then some broccoli, and then I have some peppers growing in here. And this, I believe, is spinach. It could be something else. I'm pretty sure that's my spinach. It might be more black broccoli. This, I think, is another pepper, but I'm not sure. Kind of looks different from the other thing. I think this is more spinach, but it needs more time to grow. This will be pumpkins. I just planted these though, so they won't be out for a while. This is my favorite plant that is doing well, despite the little numbs of from the bugs biting my plant. And it's starting to grow some flowers, which I like. Most people don't let grow, but I let them grow because then you get seeds. <laughs> this is my 
beans. Oh, these are beans. I think that's my spinach in there. This is my orange tree, and it has an orange. Now it's growing more flowers now that it's warmer up. And I'm so very happy about that. <laughs> this is a Fresatia tree. I think that's how you say that. Oh, it's a Fresatia tree, but it will grow yellow flowers. Maybe not this year, but like next year. This is some. Oh, hold on. What kind of trees are those? Maple trees. <laughs> Sorry, it's kind of warm in here. Yeah, these are some maple trees that I'm trying to regrow. They did have big leaves, but then it got too cold out. This is my succulent in a little cactus that I that I uh, rescued. It was gonna get thrown out at the garden center, but I bought it for full price, so I was able to get it. But I bought it for full price. They won't let you get a discount. Because I don't know. The people need to be paid. Anyway, but it was like just a tiny little ball and then it grew this stump thing and then it started growing these little arm things and it has two more that are going. <laughs> this is my <sighs> tomato plants. Which if you go like this when they're starting to flower. It will encourage it to grow more flowers, and then you get more tomatoes. But yeah. Oh, I have more plants in the back. Ow. Sorry. This is kind of short. I guess things I often run into. I have a yellow delicious apple tree growing here and over here I have this is magnolia tree it's kind of taking its time to grow any flowers but it is starting to grow some leaves down here and then that pretty purple flowery thing is my lilac bush Ingredients, my food. This is my calabine, which is what the calabine will look like when it gets older. It'll be pretty like this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I just realized I didn't actually show you guys this earlier. This is what I meant by the calabine when it gets older. This is what it looks like when it's little. It's just a bunch of leaves, but it will start growing those f pretty red flowers later. There are some blue ones, and I think there is a yellow one, but I have the red one. So they're pretty. And then I have some kind of for the kitty. Yeah. The kitty will be happy later, but I don't think it's old enough right now. For me to give it to her, so I gotta wait. And these are some trees, which I'm not sure if they're doing really good. I still feel like they have life. Then this one is trying really hard. It's got some leaves down here. I think this is catnip too, but I'm not sure. Then I think I have some more over here, but I gotta see what happens with them. And that's all my plants. Fun collecting seeds from that. There's another calabone right there. And then if I go over here, I have a balloon tree growing. A balloon, not a balloon tree, a balloon plant growing. That does belong there. It's, it's probably something I shouldn't be touching, but I don't want my. It's a balloon and plant to die, so it's going to. Anyway, this is a balloon plant and it'll grow some pretty blue flowers that when they're forming, they look like little balloons and that's why it's called a balloon plant. 
and then they pop when they open. But they're cool. Yeah, I'm really glad this is starting to grow because I was starting to worry about it. But it's going. I did have a dragon breath plant over there, but it was in the annual, so it died. And then there's a bunch of oof, wild flowers growing, and they're still pretty. So I let them live. There's some more over there. And we have some, some berry trees, which we can't eat these. They're for the birds, not for humans. But they're pretty. Very pretty. Um, I believe that's all my plants. So if you liked this video, like it. And if you like more, want to see more of my videos, subscribe and share with your friends. Alright. I hope you had fun. Bye.